Hello, my name is Christos and you are watching the Intern Game Plan. If you're looking to secure an internship, then you've come to the right place. So this is the beginning of a series of videos. It's really going to help you uh, make a comprehensive plan of action if you want to land a very competitive internship, such as in investment banking. Um, now let's just begin, you know, say you want to eventually land a full-time role in investment banking or in another competitive financial sector. Um, what you need to do is really land an internship. Now an internship is that thing between your penultimate year, your second and third year usually of university, perhaps a 10 week experience where you get experience for the role and it's almost an, an extended interview uh, for the full-time role. Now to get that, this is what the course is about. You need to cover a few kind of components, a few steps of the application system um, to eventually stand out and essentially get the offer. Um, just as a caveat, a side note, um, if you're kind of in your first year and you're not in a position to be able to apply to internships, I still think this is actually a very useful thing for you to watch. In fact, I think you're in a better position, if anything, because you know you have that spring application process, which springs are like kind of insight week experiences for first years. You have that to kind of try out the application season to improve, to kind of attempt it. Um, and also, if say you're going for an industry like consulting, um, do note that sometimes the internship is slightly different. Sometimes the internship is more competitive than the grad scheme. Um, but still, you know, it is very common for consultant, like people aspiring to become consultants, to maybe try out a, a more specific kind of investment banking internship and a move to consulting. So I still really recommend um, this course for you. So just as a brief introduction, like who am I? What kind of right do I have to share these tips? And I, I, don't, I don't see this as me teaching. I see this as more sharing what works for me because it, it is a very difficult process. If, if not the most difficult thing you'll probably do at university and it's, it's really useful just to have hacks and strategies that will just you know release the stress and help you actually enjoy the process help you actually really relish the process um, in what can be such a long and time-consuming pursuit so i'm a second year economic student at the university of warwick and i'm going into my third year next year which will be my final year um, and i also landed a uh, an internship at a company called torch partners which is a technology advisory firm so they're a boutique and they focus on you know uh, technology verticals, so some might refer it to as TMT, but it's mainly focused on technology um, and you know, really kind of an exciting area for me personally, being interested in technology. Um, but I also landed an offer at Barclays Investment Bank for, the, for their internship, um, but I decided to go with Torch because of personal interests. Um, so hopefully with these tips, I'll help you also maximize your chances of success in landing what can be very competitive um, internship processes. Also, I'm um, fortunate enough to be one of the co-chairs of the Warwick Finance Societies, which is um, the largest kind of society on the Warwick campus. And through that, I've been able to really hear a lot of advice from other people. And, you know, I really want to kind of pay that forward. I want to add, give those strategies to you in a way through technology, through leveraging kind of like YouTube and the internegameplan.com website, which you can visit for free. And you can, you can see all the different blog posts um, and also there you know I've reviewed hundreds of CVs and um, I've given people mock interviews been you know hearing and following people throughout their process and um, so hopefully I'll be able to kind of condense that information and share it in a very concise and ultimately a very actionable um, way together with me as well is my friend Ben uh, so Ben is at the University of Birmingham and he's going to be helping kind of really harness together the kind of the website and, and launch the videos and um, really put you know get this to you because at the end of the day it can be very um, confusing in terms of where to go in this internship process and hopefully making this very clear and comprehensive um, should help you. So without further ado, um, this is the beginning of that series, um, you know, hopefully you started here. Um, there's going to be a series of videos covering what will essentially be three stages. Um, the first stage is pre-application, the second stage is making the shortlist, so you know, just kind of the automated part. And the final stage is convincing that interviewer, which is perhaps the most difficult stage, but the stage that fewest people reach to. Um, so that's gonna be a really interesting three-part component series to kind of cover. And hopefully that just breaks it down for you. You know, I think it, it becomes very overwhelming to try and think, think of this as some very extended, long, impossible pursuit. But if you just break it down into three components and then sub-components within those, and it's all about just you know, getting those components under control. That's all this is. And you know, within that, hopefully you can begin enjoying it, enjoying the process and really, um, yeah, relishing it. So hopefully that helps. Stay tuned. 
Do sign up to the newsletter if you want to check out the internetgameplan.com and if you actually like the post. If you don't like the post, that's completely fine. Um, and you know, feel free to subscribe as well to this YouTube channel. We'll be posting uh, the videos on here. Um, again, if you don't want to subscribe, that's absolutely fine. Hopefully we'll find you anyway through the YouTube algorithm. Um, and yeah, I look forward to seeing you in the next one.